So I'd just like to run you through the barrel filling features of the Marksman pump. So we'll go into the barrel filling screen. Now the first thing that we need to do is set the barrel size. So up in the top corner you can see barrique, hogshead and puncheon. If you touch those it presets them to the volumes of those containers. But for this example we're going to set the barrel size at 60 litres. Now if we go into the barrel parameters you can see that we have speed settings here uh, for the gentle start as well and we have our slow down volume set at 20 litres and for this instance we're going to have the ullage volume set at 0 litres. So we'll enable filling mode and if we say start the pump now it will start filling up the tub. And you can see that the gentle start is active. And what will happen is that when it gets to 40 litres, which is 20 litres before the 60, it will slow down. And then at 60 litres, it will stop. And let us know that the barrel is full. Okay, and you can see that it has counted one barrel. So if we start the pump again, So you can see on the screen that it shows you the volume of the current barrel and the total volume that's been transferred for the session. Now for the third example, I'm actually going to put in a volume of 10 litres of ullage. So if we start the pump now, on the next run, it will only put 50 litres into the tank. And you can see at the top of the barrel that it now says ullage is set at 10 litres. Now for the last example, I'm actually going to set the barrel volume at 70 litres and we'll make the ullage zero. The slowdown volume is 20 litres, so at 50 litres it will slow down. But I'm actually going to use the barrel remote control. So this is a radio remote unit and you'll see that when we switch it on, on the screen it will switch across to radio active and we can put the barrel sensors into the bunghole of the barrel which I'll do by hanging over here to simulate being inside the barrel and we can start it from the radio remote now you'll see that when the volume gets to 50 litres, the pump will still enter its slow down mode. So this will stop, this will help overfilling any barrels or having any spillage. So that when it gets close to the top, it slows down. And it will stop automatically when it hits the top sensor. Once we've done this, we can go into the store history function and we'll leave the job description and the tank as they are. So say continue. Again, you choose your name from the list and say continue. And if we go into the history function now, you'll see that the bottom entry that's recorded transferred 233 liters. And over in the notes column, you can see that it was four barrels that were transferred. The barrel emptying feature is very similar to the barrel filling feature. It has a display showing how much liquid is left in the barrel. You set your barrel size and using the barrel emptying spear again with your radio remote you just switch it over to emptying mode and the barrel spear can detect when there is air in the line showing that the barrel 
is empty. It has the same setup as the barrel filling in regards to store history and number of barrels count. So it's virtually the same function as barrel filling.